Welcome back to the channel. If you're looking to upgrade your internet experience, you're in the right place. Buying a Wi-Fi router can be a little daunting, but trust me, it's worth it. Not only can the right router boost your speeds, but it can also save you money in the long run. In today's video, we're diving into the best Wi-Fi routers for 2024, helping you make the best choice for your home or office. Let's get started! 1. TP-Link Archer AX21 With its 5 GHz band, the entry-level dual-band Wi-Fi 6 router TP-Link Archer AX21 can reach up to 1,201 megabits per second, 1.2 gigabits per second, at peak speed. It's not fancy, but in our tests, it provided almost perfect performance for small to medium-sized households. Moreover, TP-Link's Tether app makes it very easy to set up and operate. The best part is that the AX21 held its own in tests against other, comparable routers from brands like Asus and Netgear, offering better range, lower latency, and quicker download rates. You can get a decent home networking upgrade that's as easy and inexpensive as it gets with the addition of functional band steering mode, which automatically switches between the 2.4 and 5 GHz bands within a single network. You can also get guest network controls and even a quality of service engine, which prioritizes traffic to the most important devices on your network. While it can't reach gigabit network maximum speeds, it can reach steady close range rates of about 700 megabits per second, which is more than sufficient for the majority of homes. 2. TP-Link Deco W7200 To get the most out of your mesh router, look for one that supports Wi-Fi 6 and has a tri-band design, which consists of three distinct traffic bands, the standard 2.4 and 5 GHz bands and an extra 5 GHz band that the system can use as a dedicated wireless backhaul for transmissions between the router and its satellites. The TP-Link Deco W7200 gets you there for $200, although most mesh routers of that kind cost at least $300 or even $400. I've never found a better value on a tri-band mesh router that supports Wi-Fi 6, and it turns out to be a great performance. In fact, the AX6000 version of Netgear Orbi, which costs more than three times as much, is the only system that was able to completely surpass it in my at-home speed testing. Furthermore, TP-Link satellite extenders instantly join the mesh as soon as you plug them in, making the setup procedure as simple as it gets. 3. Asus RTAX86U for ardent gamers, gaming routers offer great performance and minimal latency, and they sometimes retail for as much as $400. Although the Asus RTAX86U dual-band router costs less than $300, it is still a good deal when compared to other routers of that kind, and its gaming performance is outstanding. The router's latency control is really impressive. It really has the lowest average latency of any router I've ever tested, gaming or not, which will undoubtedly appeal to online gamers. Another great combination of app-based features and controls it provides is a mobile boost mode that lets you prioritize gaming traffic to your phone at the push of a button. Aside from its gaming capabilities, the RTAX 86U supports Wi-Fi 6 fully and has robust, consistent speeds in a reasonable range. You may make it the hub of a mesh network by adding other Asus AI mesh devices to your home network if you want more range. That fulfills every need that the majority of consumers have for an excellent gaming router and does so at a cost that allows us to suggest it. One of the greatest Wi-Fi 6 routers available right now, even if you're not a gamer. 4. Netgear Orbi Dual Band AC1200 Apart from not supporting Wi-Fi 6 and being less feature-rich than more expensive models, the Netgear Orbi mesh router in the mesh category is a great value for the money when it comes to the AC1200 model. It's a very affordable system that kept up with both Nest Wi-Fi and the Wi-Fi 5 version of Amazon's Aero mesh router in our speed tests, at around $50 for a 3-device setup with the Wi-Fi router and two satellite extenders, it's currently priced around $50. It would be a great fit in homes with internet speeds of 300 megabits per second or less. 
When we mapped those signals out at the CNET Smart Home, we found that the Netgear Orbi system had the strongest signal strength and the quickest average peak speed among those three systems. Even the design, with its stylishly vending heat-releasing curves on top, appeals to me. Try this inexpensive setup if you're interested in mesh routers but deterred by their exorbitant price. 5. Netgear Orbi Tri-Band AX6000 the AX6000 version of the Netgear Orbi is much more costly than the dual-band version mentioned above, starting at around $400 for the two-piece system shown above, but it is also far more powerful. The system continues to be our most tested mesh router, scoring the highest in both our at-home mesh coverage and lab-based top-speed testing. It also has full support for Wi-Fi 6, with a second 5 GHz band acting as a dedicated backhaul for system transfers between the router and its satellites. The Orbi AX600 yielded average speeds of 289 megabits per second to Wi-Fi 5 devices and 367 megabits per second to Wi-Fi 6 devices in the second round of tests at my house on a 300 megabits per second fiber internet connection. Among the speeds at the farthest point from the router were 95% as fast as when connected up close. That's an almost flawless outcome that no other mesh system I examined could equal. Is a performance that quick really worth $400? Most people, in my opinion, will get greater value from something less costly, and there are an increasing number of excellent solutions that meet this need. This is the system to acquire if you're shopping right now and want superior mesh performance without worrying about cost.